What is going on everyone? Shaken Big 2355 here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Madden 18 Jaguars franchise. Today our 9-3 Jacksonville Jaguars travel to Jerry's World to take on the 3-9 Dallas Cowboys. We have some playoff implications in this one. We'll get to that right away in the video. But Dallas, or I'm sorry, Dak Prescott, I almost said Dallas Prescott. 1,100 yards, 11 touchdowns, 3 picks, must have been injured. Russo, 2,100 yards, 23 touchdowns, 7 interceptions. And as you can see there, Houston Texans have lost to the Titans. Therefore, a win for us, and we clinched the AFC South. So a lot of motivation for the boys in this one. Russo going to find Allen Robinson getting all the way up to the 8-yard line. Setting up a first and goal. It's second and goal now. Finds Marquise Lee on the slant route for the touchdown. Jaguars up 7-0 here towards the end of the first quarter. Four minutes to go. Third and 14. Next possession for the Cowboys. Dak Prescott getting flushed out of the pocket. And this is why you never throw across your body. Intercepted by A.J. Boye. And he's going to try to take this one to the house. Uh, bobbing in and out, of, but can't quite get to the end zone, but he does have a nice return. We would go three and out on our possession, but that would set up a 35-yard field goal attempt for Jason Myers. He is good. 10-0 Jaguars here. Move to four minutes to go in the first half, third and three. TJ Russo is going to force this one. It's intercepted by TJ McDonald. And... So the Cowboys have a chance to score here. Get on the board before halftime. That is snuffed out right away. Talvin Smith. Seventh sack of the year for the captain. And that would do it for halftime. Be 10-0 Jaguar lead going into the half. And like I said, with a win, we clinch the AFC South. Third and 14. Jaguar is going to come out firing here in the second half. D.D. Westbrook. Beautiful catch. Kind of throws in a triple coverage. Maybe shouldn't have thrown it, but he did anyway. Sets up a third and ten. And, well, might as well finish what you start. Touchdown, D.D. Westbrook. 17-0 Jaguars. Six minutes to go in the third quarter. After another three and out from the Cowboys. Uh, Russo's going to find a Lee there to move the chains. Very next play, Leonard Fournette. His best run of the game. Goes over a 1,000 yards on the season with that carry. He would eventually leave with an injury and not return. Third and eight. Going to find Allen Robinson. And he's going to get knocked down at the one-yard line. Very next play. Again, finish what you started. Allen Robinson, touchdown. Jaguars take a 24-0 lead against the last place 3-9. Cowboys start of the fourth quarter. Third and 11. Going to find Des Bryant. Getting up to the 30-yard line. Only his second completion of the day at that point for Prescott. He had a rough one. But very next play, though, he's going to find Des Bryant. Makes a couple guys miss. That's been an issue for our defense all year. Poor tackling. They're on the board 24-6. Game's not over yet. Second and six from their own 42. Finds Lee on the corner route. He's going to get up into field goal range to the 24 of Dallas. Third and six from the 20. Finds Luke Wilson. Had a somewhat quiet day, but still a pretty productive game. Six catches, I believe. That would set up an 18-yard field goal attempt as we're just trying to make it a three-score game. It makes it 27-6 here. So three minutes to go in the game. Uh, play action of Jeremy Stewart. Hit as he throws. Finds Terrence Williams. Set up a first and goal from the two. It had a false start penalty. Second and goal from the five. Finds Terrence Williams. It's a common theme in this one. Finish what you start. So now they need this onside kick to keep the game going. Down two scores at the two minute warning. But Walter Dixon going to be the hero for the Jags in this one. Falling on the ball. And then Chris Ivory is going to leave no doubt in anyone's mind with the touchdown run. Leaving no doubt Making it so the Jacksonville Jaguars are your AFC South champions. They get a 34-13 win in Jerry's World on the road 
And it's not an easy place to play. Obviously, the Cowboys always tough to play at home, but they're not having a great year. It's still a very impressive road win with a lot of pressure on for the boys uh, as we, like I said, clinched with the win. Russo had a pretty good day. Three touchdowns, one pick. Fournette, 83 on the ground. TJ Yeldon came in, did pretty good in relief of Fournette after he got injured. Wilson, 6 of 60. Robinson, 6 for 87 and a score. Lee, 5 for 63 and a score. Bryant, 4 for 65 and a score. Westbrook, 62 and a score. Common theme that seems like among receivers. Gave up two sacks in this one on offense. Lindsey Henderson led the way with at t- eight tackles for us. And I'm going to talk a little bit about the playoffs now so you can see the defensive stats as we go along. But yeah, the Jacksonville Jaguars, we have clinched the AFC South, making the playoffs for the first time since 2007. That's 12 years because we are in 2018. Maybe 11 years, but 12 seasons. And won the division for the first time ever since being in the AFC South. We won, They won it twice when it was the old AFC Central in 98-99. So the first time in almost 20 years. That's going to do it for today's video, guys. If you want to enjoy it, please do leave a like down below. Be sure to subscribe for more Jaguars franchise. As always, thanks for watching. Till next time, peace.